What's up guys, welcome back to yet another video. I always wanted a dedicated gaming mod on Pixel devices. And most people like me who are into gaming used to miss such features on custom ROMs like Pixel Experience ROM. But now with Android 12, Google started to add this new gaming dashboard on their Pixel devices. So here I have my OnePlus 8 on which I am running the Pixel 5 ported version of Android 12 Beta 3.1. I have already made a video on this. If you guys are interested in installing this OS on your OnePlus 8 and 8 Pro, then I'll leave the video link in the description below. Also, we have got the high resolution wallpapers from Pixel 6 series. If you want to download those wallpapers, link can be found in the description below. These are static wallpapers which can be directly applied on your any Android device. Now let's take a quick look on the game dashboard which is present on Android 12 for Pixel devices and we'll see what additions they have done in this new gaming dashboard. So talking about enabling it, you can directly enable it from the settings panel. Just head to the settings panel and search for game settings. Here you'll get two options. One is game dashboard and the second one is do not disturb for games. And now let's launch a game. After you launch the game, you'll see an arrow mark towards the right side or the left side. Just tap on it, you'll get the icon of game dashboard. And these are the features what we get in the game dashboard. On the top side, we have few options. One is do not disturb. The second one is FPS counter. Once you enable this, here you can see we get the FPS count right now. Next one is screen recording and the screenshot shortcut. So tapping on these things will create a shortcut and which will be handy while doing gaming. And after that, there are two additional features which are one of my favorite. One is YouTube live. You can directly stream your gameplays using this game dashboard. And the second one is game optimization. So currently I've tried with multiple games. I've always seen this game optimization is not available for this specific game. I'm not sure whether it has been enabled on this Android 12 beta 3.1. We have to wait for the stable build and let's see how Google optimize this feature for gaming. And now let's play a small game and see how does this FPS meter shows the FPS count. So as you can see here, we have created shortcut for everything like screen recording, screenshot shortcut, and the FPS meter. We'll also record the gameplay. But one thing which I personally want Google to add on Android 12 is different resolution selection for game recording. So once you tap on this screen recording, we don't have any option here to select the resolution of the recording. In recording audio, we do get these things like audio recording, sound from your device like music, calls and ringtones. Then second, we have microphone. And the third one is device audio and microphone. Currently we'll keep it as device audio. After that we have this option to enable show touch on the screen. So we'll keep it disabled. We'll start the screen recording and let's play a game now. Also it would be great if Google gives some option to hide or to decrease the opacity of this game dashboard. Because I personally feel this will be a distraction while gaming. But that's okay. Let's give it a try and we'll play one TDM match. And we have only two options to keep this game dashboard shortcut either on the left corner or on the right corners. So as you guys saw, there wasn't any kind of mistouch on this game dashboard shortcut while gaming. So I personally feel it's a quite useful addition to Android 12. But it would have been more better if this game dashboard shortcut gets a bit of transparency. And now let me show you the recording which we did. We'll also get to know by default in which resolution recording is done while gaming. So this is the recording which we did and the best part is while doing screen recording you also have this FPS or the shortcut of game dashboard recorded in the screen recording. Talking about the resolution so by default screen recording is done in 2400 into 1080 pixels. Let's see if Google adds the ability to make changes in the resolution of screen recording. So guys, this was the quick look on game dashboard, which has been added on Android 12. I personally like the features which they have added. What are your thoughts about this game dashboard? Do let me know in the comment section below. 
as of now only this much in this video i hope you guys like the video if you like the video then do give me a thumbs up and also if you are new to our channel do not forget to subscribe the channel thanks for watching have a great day